Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Savannah and today we are continuing our mystical motherhood challenge. Sorry for the delay in videos. I've been going through some stuff and uh, I needed a few days off. <laughs> it was spring break for me and uh, yeah, it was just super nice to have just a teensy little break. Been playing a lot of Animal Crossing, <laughs> like a lot. I already beat the main storyline. Uh, if you guys are playing it too, you know how addicting it can be. But yeah, I've missed playing Sims, haven't played in a while. I did build the uh, Christmas baby room, so I'm excited to show you guys that. In this episode, I'm hoping we can have ourselves some vampire babies, and I'm not sure who else we're gonna uh, go after in this episode, but I'm excited to find out, so let's get into it. Okay guys, here we are back in the lot. I am very excited to show you guys this Christmas room. Uh, but first I wanted to address like the, oh there's our butler, why does it always change? I don't know, but I did ask you guys in the last episode if we should keep the old rooms or if we should just get rid of them and change them as we go along. And it was like 50-50, a lot of you guys were saying that it would just take up way too much room and I agree 100%, but then the other half of you guys were saying that it's nice to have them to look back on and then like once we're done with the challenge it'll be like a giant just museum. <laughs> And I think that would be kind of cool too. So I don't know. I'm like torn. I think we'll we'll decide the more that we play. But uh, I'm going to show you guys the uh, Christmas baby room right now. I made it downstairs just off of the living room. And uh, yeah, this is it. I like it a lot. I went more of a traditional Christmas route. Uh, just really cozy, really like a uh, winter cabin-y feel. I was debating if I wanted to do this or like a white and gold, but since they're toddlers, I thought maybe more of like a family, family oriented, I don't know what I'm saying, <laughs> but I thought this would be more appropriate. So yeah, obviously there's a Christmas tree in here. I just sized it down a little bit. Here's our two little beds. I pretty much put every single Christmas decoration there is in The Sims out. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, I actually really like how it turned out, even though it's a bit, um, cluttered. I kind of like that look. So yeah, this is the room. I hope that you guys like it. I hope that the toddlers like it too. Uh, I wish toddlers could claim beds. <sighs> maybe, 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 maybe we should just lock all of these doors up here so that the only option they have is to sleep in their in their bedroom so let's let's just lock for everyone there's no reason anyone should be going in these rooms okay beautiful that's all taken care of oh it looks like juniper's here and of course one of the babies is making a mess it wouldn't be a new toddler if it wasn't making a mess so just a little refresher since it's been a while since the last episode we finally had babies with santa what the heck is his name clement <laughs> Some of you guys commented that you thought that the romance between uh, Brenna and Clement was so uncomfortable and weird just because he's like an old man. I get it, but that thought didn't even cross my mind when I was doing it. I just thought it was funny and I was like having fun. <laughs> so yeah, oh you're gonna make a mess in here and then come over here and make another mess? Wow, you're great. You're just great. But yeah. This is Noel and Nick. Uh, and then some of you guys were saying that we can't have babies with Servo. And that really bums me out. I don't know if there's like a mod that we can get. But even if we did have babies with him, I kind of feel like they would just come out to be normal. Like, I don't even think that they would have a special trait. Robot creation. It's my creation. You didn't even make this. Patchy did. Okay, bye, Juniper. You have a great day now. Why are you so uh, nauseous? Are you pregnant? Why don't you just come over here and throw up anyway? There you go. Feeling better now. Um, some of you guys were saying that I spelled Noel wrong, or I spelled it in like the male version. But um, when I think of Christmas, um, I think of this kind of spelling because it's, it's like on some Christmas decorations and it's like also in songs spelled like this. So that's why I spelled it like that. But some of you were saying that the girl version is N-O-E-L-L-E, -L -L -E, but like, I mean, that's the beauty of names, right? You can uh, literally spell them however you want. It doesn't matter. There's like no correct spelling for names. 
Uh, so I'm just gonna leave it the way that it is. But I love them. They're so cute, but they keep getting into trouble. All they're doing is freaking making a mess and playing in the cabinets. Maybe we should do some disciplining. I mean, it doesn't really matter. Uh, let's firmly express disappointment. Oh man, these toddlers. They're so just rotten. Spoiled. Spoiled rotten, <laughs> whatever you want to call it. All right, so let's go ahead and invite over... Where's our vampire man? This guy, Esteban. Invite to hang out at current lot. So yeah, that's our vampire baby daddy. And then we still need to work on Grim. We still need to work on Nadine, who's the tragic clown. Um, you know what would be funny? <laughs> you guys remember Genji, right? I mean, how could you not? But uh, if we do decide to get the mod to have a baby with a ghost and it actually works, what if we had a baby with Genji's ghost? <laughs> that would be so funny, but so weird. What was that? Oh, cool. Nice, 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 nice. Is the vampire here yet? Oh, there he is with his no pants. He's ready. He's freaking ready for us, guys. Heartfelt compliment. Is he feeling flirty? Party in the bathroom or what? There's nothing even to clean up here. Lady, go away. Okay, yeah, he is feeling flirty. So let's get her pregnant again with him. Oh, cool. They can already try for baby. That's great. That's great. See, that's the perks of getting the relationship up early. Is so you can just, when it's the time, when it time comes, there you go. You can just do it. Bam. Oh my gosh, Butler, will you do some disciplining? I mean, are, are you capable of doing stuff like that? Why are you blushed? Are you feeling flirty too? Servo is still working out, you guys. Bro, he's feeling pumped! Y'all done yet? Hurry up! <laughs> okay, let's have her take a pregnancy test. I'm so excited for vampire babies. I love vampires in The Sims. Ever since Ren. <laughs> Our freaking Fertile Bean Brenna. That's her nickname, Fertile Bean Brenna. Are you happy? <laughs> awkward encounter. <laughs> Why is it awkward between the toddler and him? I'm confused. Okay, so let's get her uh, in labor and all that kind of stuff. So pregnancy phase, wait, 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 offspring. Wait, 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 what does she have right now? Two males, holy cannoli. Okay, no, we need one male and one female, and then we need to be in labor. Okay, great. That was the fastest pregnancy in the history of man. Let's go ahead and have the baby at the hospital. Hopefully it doesn't glitch out again. We're going to join her. We're going to join her. Oh, vampire names. I need to look at your guys' comments. Oh my god, this comment by Natalie. Brenna gets pregnant. CC quality has left the chat. Yo. <laughs> that is so true. Okay, there's this comment by uh, Leanna Hornsby. These are some great names for vampires. Uh, for a girl, Draculara, Dawn, Ash, Drusilla, and Moon. And then for boys, Night, Dawn, Dust, Ash, Alaric, Spike, Draven, Drake, and Edward. I think for the girl, we're gonna go with Dawn, and for the boy, we're gonna go with Ash. I like those. They're great. Ooh, we got Dr. Evil! Oh my god, I missed you! I missed you so much! For a second there... Who was it that was delivering our babies? It was some other girl. I think it was her. Alicia. Not 100%, but hey, it's whatever. What are you guys doing? chat okay that's fine just don't do any romantic stuff i hate how uh you can't check in or like quickly 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 have the baby like they just stand out here for a while oh there she goes thank you thank you thank you thank you okay time for these vampire babies i'm very very excited okay so for the girl we were gonna go with dawn and for the boy ash ash Ay ayala I love that name. That is a good name. Thank you, Dr. Evil. We missed you. And it looks like both of them are vampires. Thank goodness. Thank you, Doctor. We'll be seeing ya. 
very, very soon. <laughs> Go Servo, go Servo. Okay, so we've got Santa's kids, we've got vampires. Oh right, we need to um, age them up. Right. Oh, do you guys like this um, reindeer mirror? I thought this was so cool. Uh, it was like a CC pack of different kind of mirrors, but I really liked that one, I thought it was awesome. Okay, time to age up these babies because babies in The Sims are Useless. Useless. Come on. I really like this outfit on you, by the way. Very uh, Christmassy. Goes with the theme of the episode a little bit. Woo! Woo! Happy birthday, Dawn. So you are independent. Thank you, Lord. I love independent toddlers. They are the absolute best. Next. Next. <laughs> Come on. All right, and Ash, what? How did we get this lucky? How? Okay, oh my goodness, this poor child. She looks like a vampire toddler, not gonna lie. Let me see this one. Can I see? Can I see this one? Can I see? Can I see his face? Aww. Okay. Well, he definitely got his dad's pale skin, and she got like a mix, an even mix. So let's check them out and create a sim and give them their little vampire makeovers. God, this outfit's a vibe. I want it in real life. So we're doing Dawn first, our little independent vampire. Oh my goodness, those eyes, they're huge. Wow, okay, um, no lie. This is one of the cutest toddlers I have ever seen or had in my game. I'm obsessed with her, but her nose mask, uh, the color's wrong. It needs to be... Yeah, there we go. Okay. Yeah, wow. She's like super, super cute. Super cute. Um, should we model her after the dad with the dark brows and the light hair? Or should we just do brown? <sighs> I don't know. I'm torn, but I really love her. She's very cute and every hair looks good on her. Okay, so this is what I decided for the hair and the face and all that. I think she looks super, super cute. I like her a lot. I see a lot of her dad in her. So let's see vampire outfits. Oh, this is going to be hard. You guys, <laughs> look at these shoes and socks. Oh my god, this is my favorite piece of toddler CC I've ever found. This is by Redhead Sims. It's a sock and shoe combo. <laughs> I wanna die at how cute that is. Oh my god. I think I'm gonna put her in this uh, super intricate dress, cause why not? And I'm debating if I wanna keep on the, um, the gloves, should we? Are they a vibe or are they not? Perhaps not. Look at this little dress. <laughs> I'm like debating between that one and this one. She'd probably be more comfortable in this one. What the heck am I saying? She's not real. But anyway, here's Dawn. Here's our vampire baby. She's very, very pretty. We should give her some uh, vampire teeth actually, just to make it more official. Let's see, should she have those, or these, or these, or these? Oh, they're so small. Let's go with those ones. Okay, let's work on her brother now. Okay, very chubby cheeks. Okay guys, here is Ash. I made them both blonde hair, blonde haired with really dark eyebrows like their dad. I don't know, I, gotta li I like that look for a vampire. And then I put, just put him in this little suit. So yeah, they're vampire toddlers. Um, who should we work on next? So we've done Patchy, Alien, Mermaid, Vampire, Father Winter, and we have Flower Bunny, Spellcaster, Plant Sim, Island Elemental, Grim Reaper, Tragic Clown, Robot question mark, Ghost question mark. Okay, so I think that the next babies we should focus on are our Spellcaster babies. Ooh. Parenting level six. That's what's up. And now we need a vampire bedroom. Oh, oh new boy. Okay. <laughs> I swear I'm building freaking bedrooms left and right in this let's play. No complaining. Um, I like building, but like. 
They're so cute. He looks like a little man. I'm glad the play animation is working now because uh, before, if you watched my the last episode of my Legacy Challenge, <laughs> it wasn't working at all. Oh my god, one of you guys commented and we never saw the garden again. <laughs> Man, that's so true. I am not gonna pay any attention to it or the rocket like ever again in this Let's Play, but hey, it is what it is. Oh, are you having fun in the Christmas room? Okay, so it is 6.21 a.m. and Brenna is eating spoiled lumpia. Girl, I know that lumpia is good, but not when it's spoiled. <laughs> Use your brain, darling. Why is this kitchen so nasty? We have a butler. We actually have a butler and things are gross. What is the point? I'm actually starving right now, and I just ate. All right, so which spellcaster are we going to do again? Who do we have the highest relationship with? L, right, yeah, oh, and Simeon, that was so easy. So instead of having twins with the spellcasters, you guys suggested that we have a baby per spellcaster, so there will be three of them, or we can just pick two. I don't know, but I think it would be cool to have um, babies with L and have the toddlers be pink haired. <laughs> I think that would be awesome. So I think that's what we're gonna do. Yay, she'll be right over. That's what I like to hear. Oh my God, these toddlers, they don't do anything except for make a mess. Dang, that fit though. <laughs> Hi. Yeah. <laughs> this text! Is it weird that I like the sound of farting? A little bit, Sean. Okay, first kiss, finally. That took way too long. Uh, wow, okay, so they can woohoo. So we're gonna have to go into a creative sim and set her to be able to get people pregnant. It's what we did with the alien, so we gonna do that with her as well. I'm really excited to see their kids, actually. She is the sage of mischief. So I think that we can make her kids look really awesome with really out there CC and pink hair. Yeah, they're gonna look rad. I'm stoked. So I started a Tumblr with, um, with uh, like all the rules and everything that we've done so far. So I think uh, once I'm done, I will publish it. Or should I publish it right now? You guys are gonna have to let me know. Can they, oh my god, they can try for baby already. This game, this game, it's working out in my favor today and I am just, I am so, so stoked. Passionate, she's feeling passionate, wow. They get along really well. And that's really cool. Hey, Servo, you wanna get out of the room? Thanks, buddy, why don't you come over here and clean up after the toddlers? <laughs> You are the new Patchy. You need to uh, show us that you can be better than him. What do you mean very ho- Oh my god, there isn't any food. Ay caramba. Uh, let's see what's in here. Um, a half-eaten hot dog made by Zerg. Okay, well, Nick, there's your dinner. <laughs> well, okay, Servo, when you're done cleaning up, why don't you make everyone- Is it dinner? Nope, it's breakfast. Okay. Uh, Party size eggs and toast. Okay, love. Time to take a pregnancy test and see if you're pregante. Oh my god, what? No way. I thought you were a fertile bean. Try again. Ooh, the birth certificate. Where were we hanging those again? Wait, who's this? Oh, frick. Mermaid daddy. Oh, here they are. All right, wow. Here we go. There. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. Twelve birth certificates. Hot dog. What's going on in here? Aww, this is cute. Okay, bye Elle, but wait, 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 wait. We have to make sure we're pregnant first before you leave. Wait, don't go! Hold on, hold on. Oh my god, what the heck, why? All right. Let's take another pregnancy test. Fingers crossed. Why is it not working? Urgh. Oh, this is so weird. I've had them try for baby a bunch of times, but uh, 
it's just not working. Let's try one more time, and if it doesn't work, we're gonna have to move on to a different spellcaster. I think we'll probably do Morgan. All right, last try. Here we go. Please be pregnant. I don't know why it just doesn't work sometimes. I wonder if it has to do with me changing her preferences, or her, um, her being able to get others pregnant thing. Okay, so I just realized that we can't make a, a, a baby with Genji's ghost because we don't have his grave, his gravestone. So that means we're gonna have to kill another Sim. Brighten his day, hug him lovingly, and then let's put him to bed, read to sleep. Oh, these toddlers don't have a bed. Well, that's an issue, isn't it? Okay, for now, I am going to put some toddler beds in the patchy baby old room. We will use these until I can make a proper vampire room. Okay, so it's 2 a.m. so I doubt anyone is going to walk by, but if they do, we will kill them. I don't know how, but we're gonna. We need to make some foul pufferfish nigiri, which means we need to get Brenna in a really bad mood. Oh, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, who are you? Who are you? Oh my god, is this the other vampire? Wow, what are the odds? Well, I guess they're pretty great, actually, since he's a vampire and it's three in the morning. But, oh, we could kill a vampire, actually. We could kill him quite easily. Hmm. Hmm. Should we? Should we have a baby with both brothers, but kill one first? We'll see who else walks by, actually. We'll see. Because I wouldn't know how to kill him. Because I don't know if he can turn into a, a bat or not and just fly out of an enclosure if we trap him. It would actually be really easy right now to kill a normal sim since it's freezing outside. We could just lock them in an enclosure until they freeze to death, and that happens pretty quick. If we have a baby with a ghost, it's just gonna look like a normal sim, by the way. I wish we could make like, tod uh, like a toddler into a ghost or a kid or any of those things, but I don't think we can. No one has walked by. Who's this? Who's this? Who are you? Who are you? Are you, are you Dr. Evil? No! <laughs> I don't want to kill you. No, 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 no. Or should we? Oh my god, he's coming to our door and everything. Oh my gosh, okay. Mm. A part of me wants to because then he'll be part of this let's play like forever. He'll be a dad. Um, and then a part of me doesn't want to because I want him to deliver all of our babies. Oh man, I'm torn. You guys are gonna have to let me know in the comments. Should we kill Dr. Evil and have him be ghost daddy if that's even possible? Or should we just do someone else? Kill off someone else and have them be ghost daddy and just have him continue to deliver our future babies? You guys are gonna have to let me know, please. Oh my god, you guys, look. I'm having her be flirty with Servo and he has heart eyes. That is so cute! <laughs> Aww, I love him. Alright, so I went ahead and I invited Morgan over just so we can uh, build up that relationship with him since for some reason we can't get pregnant with Elle and that really bothers me. We might have the same the issue with Morgan nerds. too because Morgan... Um, he can't technically get people pregnant either, so we're gonna have to change his too. So I hopefully we don't have that same problem. That would really suck. Okay, so I've been working on their relationship for a little bit. Um, it's pretty good, and we can finally have our first kiss. Oh, look at the massage action. Get it going! First kiss! Bada boom bada bing! <laughs> Oh, he's so tired. Look at his eyes. Oh, we need to change him and create a sim. <sighs> so much to do, so little time. Neither. Okay, so get others pregnant. Hopefully it works. Fingers crossed. If not, 
We're gonna have to do Simeon Silver Sweater. Okay, try for baby. Let's see if this works. Come on, girl. Oh, you mad at how messy it is in here? See, what the heck is happening, you guys? I don't know, but I'm sad. <gasps> yes! Yes, 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 yes! She did it, she did it, she did it. She's pregnant with Morgan's babies. Is he happy? Yes, he is. Very good. Very, very good. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Mwah, mwah, mwah. I wonder if this butler is just like super hardcore judging us and our life choices. <laughs> Because she sees everything that goes on. Like, absolutely everything. <laughs> Alright, so I think we will end this episode with her cleaning out the spoiled food. Because that's just disgusting. <laughs> and then we can uh, have her have the first batch. Or actually, okay, so I'm going to get her to have the baby. She's in labor. But I'm kind of, since we're having one kid per sage, I think, or just two, I don't know yet. I kind of want her to have a male baby with Morgan and a female baby with L. So we're going to change the offspring to one male and zero female. And yeah, let's have the baby at the hospital. Join. And then uh, once we figure out what the issue is with L. Hopefully, fingers crossed, because I really want her to have a baby with her. Then we'll have a female with her. Jeez. <laughs> a lot of way. Jeez. <laughs> oh, darling. Oh my gosh, you're so miserable. Dude, now is not the time to make snow angels. It's really not. Okay, here we go. Our male baby with Morgan. Oh, shoot. Names. You guys have given me so many good spellcaster names. I really like Sabrina for the girl, so I think we're gonna do that. And I really like Merlin for a boy. Merlin and Sabrina. I think that's so cute. A lot of you guys uh, suggested like Hermione and Harry, Draco, Zelda. I like all names, but it sucks that I can only choose one. But thank you everyone who is giving me names. You guys are seriously lifesavers. So what did I say for a boy? Right, Merlin. That's such a freaking magical name. I love it. I love it so much. Uh, I read this from a comment by Sadie Gilligan. Thank you, Sadie. And thank you to everyone else who suggested that name as well. I've seen it a couple times. Cheers to you guys. Ugh. Yum. All right, Merlin. Way at though. I'm so pumped for this spellcaster baby, and since it's like Morgan, it's gonna be an intensely strong ma magician. Magician? No, spellcaster. <laughs> oh my lord. I think Morgan has gray eyes and blonde hair. Oh my gosh, so many blonde. Fussy. Why? Why me? The one time I say we don't get fussy, we start getting it all the time. Okay, well, I guess we lucked out with two independent beans. <laughs> oh. And this is just the game's way of being like, don't get too comfortable. Here's a fussy toddler for ya. Gee, thanks. All right, Merlin. Let's see. Oh, okay. I'm actually really feeling your look. So this is what it looks like without CC. For all you guys that are interested. Okay, I found these eyes. They're still like a really, really bright icy color like they were before, but like you can actually tell where the pupil or the iris or whatever you want to call that thing <laughs> is. So we're gonna go with those. Oh, wow. These brows usually look really angry on Sims, but they actually look great on him. So we gonna do that. I've noticed that all of these sims look, all of like the toddlers, they look different. And sometimes, most of the time actually, my toddlers all come out looking the same. Oh, okay, these are so cool. It's like little eye shines. I don't know if you guys can tell, but the little reflections in his eyes change shape. Oh, and there's this cool star one. That's perfect for a spellcaster. 
We gotta use that. All right, let's find him an outfit now. Oh man, a spellcaster outfit. I like this little uh, bow tie and pants combo. I really like the color. I like this color too. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Okay, let's just go with that. Let's just go with that for now. If I could find some better uh, Spellcaster CC for toddlers, then I'll switch it, but they're not even toddlers for that long. What do you guys think of this little hat? Winner, winner, chicken dinner, or nah? <sighs> I don't know. I do want him to look different than the other toddlers in a way, so... The only thing I could think of is slapping on a hat. <laughs> okay, so here is Merlin. I'm actually obsessed with him. He is so, so cute. <laughs> the hat and the gloves just, they send me. They freaking send me. I think I'm gonna end this episode right here. Please let me know what you think of our new toddlers. Let me know what you think about the ghost situation. I know that I have to get a mod to have a baby with a ghost and it's probably not gonna look any different uh, as a baby, it's just gonna look like a normal sim. Let me know if you find any cool vampire CC for when they age up, or any cool Christmas CC, or any cool, like, spellcaster CC. I have a lot of spellcaster stuff, but, uh, you know, I could always use more. <laughs> I know that a lot of you guys send me stuff on Instagram, and I really appreciate it. Alright, I love you guys so much, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!